tonight we're going to be showing you what I've been doing. i am uh, been on a contract job doing uh, Burger King installs. I'm setting up new digital mesh boards um, for big TVs. We'll be unboxing them and showing you everything we're doing. Uh, the 46 inches, we hang them up on wall brackets. We'll show you that once we get that all set up. Um, right now I'm just unboxing uh, the computer controllers. These are what gives the images to the new menu boards. I'm uh, just going to put the stands on and the uh, connectors for the video cables. And yeah, so I hope you uh, enjoy this, uh, I don't know what to call it, maybe a documentary or something, but it's just something to show everyone what I've been doing and what I'm capable of. So these are the controllers that we connect to each and every TV. We, at each site I've been doing, I can connect four controllers. They're basically small computers. Um, each one connects with a video cable and a network cable that connects it to the internet. These all then go out and pick up the content for the new menu. So it's gonna be able to update pricing. They're not gonna have to change anything um, physically by going up on a ladder and putting those sticky, uh, sticky numbers for pricing. So now they can do it all on the, your computer and it's gonna streamline a lot of a lot of these sites uh, pricing and content so you know one TV will have your combos one TV will have advertising like the new fries new smoothies um, the next TV will have drinks and kids menu and the last TV will have I believe a value menu. So right now we're in the back office we're uh, setting up the mini uh, computers that are going to be giving our displays the image and menus um, Right now I have to do pretty uh, easy stuff, it's uh, not too technical, but I have to make sure that all the um, machines have the right address so the company can connect to them and push the content to them over the internet. And then this way the displays have the proper pricing and, uh, you know, menus. Um, so right now it's just uh, three screens I gotta do, I gotta make sure the date and time is correct. So the TVs turn on and off at the proper times and go to breakfast when it's breakfast time and lunch when it's lunch time. Um, I also have to make sure it has the right internet address. An internet address is called an IP. That's kind of like uh, like your home. When you have a home address, each uh, device that connects to the internet has its own address. So I have to make sure this is all properly documented and uploaded to my company to make sure that they can give all these units the proper internet address and it's going to stay that way once we get it in. This I am just uh, prepping all of my wires, uh, power cables, network switch with network wires for the internet. Um, this is a battery backup unit in case there's ever a power failure at the site. It connects everything and we'll leave uh, the menu board controllers online for at least 30 minutes in case there's a quick you know spike in the electric. I'm just going to be Installing the controllers up here, getting them ready to go online, and then I can tell my company to make sure everything's online and they can upload the content. Right now, we're just uninstalling the old menu boards, getting ready to put up our wall brackets. Now that I have the old menu boards down, I have to use the stud finder and find some studs behind the wall so I can wall mount the brackets to the wall. This is how the finished product looks. I'm um, just finishing off the final touches, making sure everything's level. Now that I've untangled the wire, I'm going to tape it all together. It's 50 foot worth of wire that we have to fish through the drop ceiling in these locations. This is the four TVs with brackets on them. This is me putting a bracket on. I got to make sure it's level so it all the screens look level when we mount them up to the wall. So now I'm going to get started fishing the wire through this drop ceiling. I start by where the TVs are so this way I can have a starting location and the end location is going to be in the back office. When you're going through these drop ceilings I like to stick them to a broom to make it easier to maneuver and avoid other cabling in the ceiling. I don't want to rip on anything. Right here you can see I'm, I'm tugging. I don't like to do that. I'll ask for slack to make sure I don't pull on any of the existing wires. Right here I'm just making my final push towards the back office and now I'm going to connect everything to the controllers to so when I hook them into the displays they're gonna give it the new menu content. 
Um, here I'm just uh, poking my holes through the wall so the cables are run. Uh, the TVs are hung. I'm going to make the final connections. And here's what the final product looks like. Hello and thank you for tuning in to my video. My name is Jeremy Prosky. I own a computer repair business and information technology consulting company. Its name is JPP Computers LLC. This video was presented to you to just show you one of the many things that I'm capable of doing. I hope everyone enjoyed it. I wanted to give a special thanks to Chris Flores of CF Photo Video. He's the one that made all of this possible, did all my camera work, video work, audio work, and editing. Please check out my Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash JPP Computers. I'm also available via email at jeremyprohusky at gmail.com. If you'd like any more information about my company, what we're about, what we do, or any of our services, please contact me. Thank you and hope you have a good day.